In this lesson, you will understand the characteristics of comets, meteors, and asteroids. After going through this lesson you are expected to compare and contrast the comets, asteroids, and meteors. Predict the appearance of comets based on recorded data and explain the regular occurrence of meteor shower. Recent advances in space technology have allowed scientists coming from different backgrounds such as physics, chemistry, biology and geology to collaborate in studying near-Earth objects such as comets and asteroids. Comets and asteroids are referred to by astronomers as near-Earth objects. Comets are icy bodies or objects while asteroids are rocky fragments. Comets and asteroids are remnants from the formation of the solar system 4.6 billion years ago. On the table, the comparison of some characteristics of comets and asteroids. Comets and asteroids have irregular shape and varied size. They both reflect light from the sun at varying amount depending on the size and composition. Silicate are minerals which contains the elements silicon, oxygen and at least one metal which is responsible for comets and steroids to be able to reflect light. Comets and asteroids both orbit the sun. Comets usually come from the Oort cloud which is beyond our solar system and few from Kuiper belt which is just beyond Neptune's orbit. Long period comets from the Oort cloud while short period come Kuiper belt. Learning task number one. Identify if the statement is true or false. Number 1. A comet is a ball of mostly ice that moves around in the outer space. Answer true. Number 2. Comets believed to be a long elliptical orbits. Answer true. Number 3. Comets can come back into view from time to time. Answer false. Number 4. Comets are same with meteors. Answer true. Number 5. Asteroids orbit the sun. Answer. True. Learning task number 2. Complete the table and answer the following portions. Number 1. Explain what happened to a meteoroid in order for it to become a meteorite. When meteoroids enter Earth's atmosphere or that of another planet like Mars at high speed and burn up the fireballs or shooting stars are called meteors. When a meteoroid survives a trip through the atmosphere and hits the ground, it's called a meteorite. Number 2. How can you distinguish asteroids from comets? The difference between asteroid and comet is their composition made of. Asteroids are made up of metals and rocky material, while comets are made up of ice, dust, and rocky material. Both asteroids and comets were formed early in the history of the solar system. Number 3. When a meteoroid enters Earth's atmosphere, friction causes it to burn up and produce a streak of light called Answer. Meteor. Number 4. A chunk of ice and dust whose orbit is usually a long narrow ellipse is Answer. Comet. Number 5. If a meteoroid hits Earth's surface, it is called Answer. Meteorite. Number 6. An object that revolves around the sun, but is too small to be considered a planet. Answer. Asteroid. Number 7. A chunk of rock or dust in space that usually comes from a comet or an asteroid is called. Answer. Meteoroid. Number 8. The region of the solar system between the orbits of Mars and Jupiter is known as the. Answer. Asteroid belt. Learning task number 3. Read and understand the given information and fill out the Venn diagram. Place a check mark in your answer to indicate the characteristics of asteroids, comets, and meteors. Define the following terms in your own words. That ends our lesson for today. Don't forget to click the like button. And subscribe to this channel for more videos.